Welcome to another session in SharePoint Online. In today's session, we are going to see how to host an external application in SharePoint Online. For this demo, we will simply try to host the Technic Virtual Labs in SharePoint Online as an app. So, here are the few quick steps. First step, you register your app using slash layout slash 15 app regime.aspx in your developer site in your SharePoint online site. Next, you create a new provider hosted app using Visual Studio. After that, you publish and package the app and you're ready to launch your app from the SharePoint online. Let's go ahead to the demo right now. So this is a link which has lots of virtual labs where you can learn various technologies like SharePoint, SQL, Azure, PowerShell. Now, go to your SharePoint online site and go to the link slash layout. Append the link with slash layouts backslash 15 backslash app regime.aspx. Then, click generate to generate the client ID. Then click generate to click to generate the client secret. Just as you have a username and password, similarly, this is the, like the app username and the app password. Next, you can type title. We'll just type technet virtual labs app and you can type the domain as in this case this will be technet.microsoft.com and click create Once this is created, just save all these details inside a notepad. Then, then launch your Visual Studio. Click New Project. and select SharePoint add-in. Let's just type Technet app, SharePoint app. Click OK. Choose your developer link for the SharePoint online and select provider hosted, click next. If prompted for the user ID and password, type the user ID and password. Just select ASP.NET Platform application. Then click finish. Now, we are just going to ignore the web part of this project. Open up the app manifest.xml. Over here, change the start page to the technique link. And go to the code. and update the client ID which you had created for your app. Save and then package your app or publish.
Click new. Let's create a new profile. Click next. Copy the client ID and client secret. Copy paste. I'm sorry. Click finish. Then click package the add-in. Type the URL of the virtual labs. Then click finish. So once the packaging is done, the, the app just folder just opens up. Copy and paste it in a location you like. Let's just paste it in desktop. Now go back to your developer side. Click apps and testing. Or to your app catalog site. And upload the app. Select new app to deploy. Then click upload. Click browse and select the folder from which you had. Let's go to desktop and select the app. Click OK. Then click deploy. Let's just trust the app. Ta da! The app is ready. You can launch the app from here or here. Let's just click that link. And virtual labs. So, so here's a quick recap. To register an external app, first to register the app in the Layouts 15 app new.aspx, you generate the client ID and client secret, and you type the hosting URL. Next, you create a new provider hosted app and update the app manifest with the client ID, and you update the start URL. After that, you publish and package the app, and upload the app in the apps in testing or in the app catalog. After that, you deploy the app and you can click the app to, to point to the link you want. If it's a custom application and you have access to the code, you can modify the HD1 page to have a Chrome control at the top if needed, which will give it the look of a SharePoint site. So this is the end of a training on how to post an external application in SharePoint Online from SharePoint app. Thank you.